Hello, my name is Hector Diaz Alberter and I'm a scientist working at the University of Glasgow on insects that transmit diseases. Kissing bugs, also known as triatomine bugs, are blood feeding insects related to bed bugs. They transmit Chagas disease, an awful parasitic illness similar to malaria that infects humans, dogs, and other mammals. The disease is caused by the parasite Trypanosoma cruzi and it can affect the heart, esophagus, and colon. If untreated, infection is lifelong and can lead to disability and death. Eight million people are currently infected with Chagas disease and 25 million are at risk. Chagas is transmitted by kissing bugs in the Americas from southern USA to northern Argentina. However, global population movement is changing the disease's distribution with recent cases in Europe, Australia and Japan, where it can be spread by blood transfusions, organ transplants or pass from mother to child. Currently there is no vaccine and drugs used in treatment have high toxicity and can produce serious side effects. Transmission takes place when a healthy kissing bug takes a blood meal from an individual infected with Chagas disease and ingests the parasites. Inside the bug, the Trypanosoma cruzi parasites develop and replicate in the gut into new infective forms. This infected bug will feed on a healthy individual, releasing the parasites in its feces. The trypanosomes enter the body through wounded skin or tissue like the eye or mouth, infecting the victim with Chagas disease. This is why we are very interested in studying the kissing bug gut. We use this tissue to perform experiments to further understand the parasite life cycle and to develop new treatments. In this video, filmed in the sanctuary of our collaborators in Mexico, I will show you how to dissect a kissing bug. Gloves will be used throughout this video. Always keep safe. Place a kissing bug three to five minutes on a petri dish on ice to anesthetize it. Bring the bug to the dissection microscope and hold it carefully with soft tweezers on the edge of the abdomen. Using fine scissors, cut the legs off from one side and then the other. Cut the head off at the neck joint. Cut the edge of the abdomen on one side up to the thorax, avoiding the anal segment and then on the other side. Submerge the bug in the section solution and then cut this upper abdomen plate transversely near the thorax. Then, using tweezers, lift this plate to expose the gut. Just like opening an oyster. Finally, use your tweezers to separate the gut from the rest of the body. Once we have collected the gut, we can perform different experiments using this tissue. Some researchers do these dissections on kissing bugs collected from the wilderness to look for trypanosome parasites. Thanks for watching. For more information, log on to the websites on the screen and follow us on Twitter. Until next time.